iOS 26 is here and introduces a significant overhaul in its user interface design through the introduction of Liquid Glass, a new visual language that brings a translucent glass-like aesthetic to the system. Flat is out, raised glass is in. Translucency and gradient edges create subtle depth. Check out the new dock and settings quick menu. All those flat background colors in iOS 18 have been replaced with a glass-like panel. This new visual style adapts to the background and adds a layer of polish and attention to detail not seen before in any other operating system. There's an app icon refresh with all stock apps receiving a somewhat of an update with some icons going through a complete redesign. Just look at that camera icon. Now, app developers will want to pay attention to this new feature. It's called concentric rectangle or adaptive border radii. And what it is, is a, is a new UI element that automatically matches the border radius of its parent element, including the phone screen, meaning that margins and padding stay neat and uniform. So far, some pretty big changes. Is this at the cost of accessibility? See, these glass effects in UI in general rely on the transparency. Without the, the, the solid background color, we have less separation and less contrast. Does this make reading harder? And finally, the naming convention has changed. This is the succession to iOS 18, but it's not called iOS 19. Instead, Apple is opting to name their SDKs and operating systems in line with release year. So what are your thoughts? Is Apple heading in the right direction? Or is this more style over substance?